it's either just just uh, the same line here and here. So yeah, yeah. Some of the, some pieces in the bottom, but the the, the main was in is in the middle, like. And then you got a vein that's just clear right here. Yes, calcite. So right over here where the citrine is partially uh, amethyst, purple, then that would be ametrine. Ametrine, huh. that's right. That's right. I'll be darned. This stone right here. That's that's Traulita. It's ex extremely from Brazil. Nobody have it. Only Brazil product that's material though. What's something like that cost? That piece probably I can get you about four hundred fifty dollar. And say what it is again? It's a Traulita. Traulita. Yeah, it's a kind of quartz, but it's a very special quartz. Yep. Wow, that is quite beautiful. Yeah, you can see right here, you're going to see something like that. It's just like the Earth. And if you look at it, it is amazing. I love this stone. It looks like a different planet. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Hey, there well, we that's go. beautiful. And what is this uh, mineral here? It's particularly, this is a mineral that came from the, you know, the Amazon and the rainforest. That's the only place that you can find that. It's a Vivianite. That's the name of the stone. Vivianite? Yep. What a beautiful stone. It it, is. And it's not heat treated. Not at all. Just the way it comes exactly like that from the ground. That is quite beautiful. Thank you very much. You're welcome. All right, uh, what are we looking at here? Uh, we uh, are looking into a mosasaur from North Africa, from actually from Morocco, from the phosphate mines, or mines in the in Faribga. Uh, What's that's, the age of this? Uh, that's uh, actually a fossil that has lived uh, eight years, 80, 80 million years ago. Actually, it's uh, one of the aquatic. It's uh, a reptile called mosasaur that has lived uh, almost for an 80 million years. So when you when they dig it up, are all these bones embedded in sandstone? It's it's, it's in a sandstone, and uh, we got the phosphates from that quarry mm -hmm. with the with the, with the uh, the bones and the and the, and the tooth and everything. So we uh, took the bones, then we just do the cleaning, and later we do the gluing of the uh, of the reptile itself, as you see here in the image. So how much would this cost somebody? This will cost uh, roughly around like uh, twelve thousand dollars. Twelve thousand dollars, because the shipping cost and uh, yes. all that stuff that makes it. That's Plus, it. you had to build the frame to yeah, fix we have the every frame, rib, yeah. every foot. Yeah, and they have the schemat actually. It's easy to put it in. So. Wow, that is beautiful. Thank you, sir. Welcome, sir. Oh, what is the name of your company? Uh, it's Raw Morocco Gyms. All right, thanks again. Yes, I will give you the So this was all wrapped up in Brazil, what, about three months ago? No, this came by plane. So it was like 30 days ago, 25 days ago. Really? Yeah. Let's see this one. Wow. This is a nice piece. Yeah. And you sell this by the... Uh, by the weight. By the weight. Yeah. Tiny pieces like this, they go by the gram. Mm-hmm. And then larger pieces, they go by the kilo. Oh, okay. This guy? Garnisha. 
Yeah. Garnisha. Yeah. And what's what's this garnisha made out of? Rose quartz. It's all rose quartz. Yeah. And then they painted it. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, thank you. And what's this one? This is also Ganesh. No, no, but the... Uh, making from like green eventually. Green what? Green eventually. Ah. The stone is green eventually. Wow. And these are snakes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What crystal is this? Some people call these uh, alligator quartz, some people call celestial quartz. And where is it from? Brazil. It's beautiful. What something like this cost? Uh, this stone here is uh, 6000 for this stone. 6000 Yes. What's the name of your company? Uh, JS Gems. JS Gems. Thank you, sir. Hey, this thing is spectacular. Uh huh. Uh, where does it come from? This is from Uruguay. And how do they mine this without breaking it? Ah, it's it's a very complicated process. But mainly we we drill the the basalt layers, and we find like with a little camera, this, this oh. beauty inside. Then we know here's a special piece. Then we cut around it. So this was in a hollow. Correct. In a in a geode. So, so was it in a geode like that big one over there? Correct. Correct. Yeah. And. Yeah. Uh, so this is all natural. Yes, everything the natural. Uh, she, she suffered like uh, some breaks in the in the process, mm -hmm. but then it was repaired. Yeah. So, but it's the the shape is all natural there. So they built this frame for it, and but how delicate is that? I mean, it's very it delicate. Yeah, it needs to be handled very carefully. And this because is of the you see it's very thin here, so uh, it's easy easy to break. So this piece is nineteen thousand dollars. Correct, nineteen thousand dollars. Wow. Hey, thank you very much. You're welcome, my friend. Medusa. Let's show me this is a trilobite from, from Morocco. Wow. Let's see it go together again. How much something like that cost? 25. 25 bucks? Yeah. That's a good price. Yeah, 25. And uh, let's see it. Wow, like a book, yeah. a history book. Yeah. Jasper. Uh, where's it from? From Madagascar.
Where's the petrified wood from? Uh, Madagascar. Really? Yeah. It's quite beautiful. What is this material here? This is onyx from Pakistan. This is a banded green onyx with a lot of bands and green and brown stripes. I'm going to buy this one. Oh, great. It is beautiful. What's the name of your company? Our company name is Gems Mart LLC. And we are New Jersey based wholesaler. And uh -huh. in Tucson, we are located at GIGM Motel 6, right under Motel 6 billboard. Well, this is beautiful. Thank you. This is going in my house. Oh, great. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi. Uh, almost everything is 50% off the list price. Good to know. Right? So what is this beautiful stone? Chrysanthemum stone from China. And have they etched that out or is that the way it comes? It comes that way. Hang on. naturally in the stone and then they just Etch carve away yeah. yeah yeah they just carve away some so is that calcite or no no that's 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 the mineral yeah Chris ah. yeah and that's about three hundred dollars during the show yes yeah. otherwise it would be twice that much wow was, yeah. what's the name of your company ah muse cool a i know right yeah. ah muse a h H H M U S E. You're all welcome to come visit. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. What's that material? It's a uh, lapidolite. That is beautiful. How long do you think it takes to carve that out? It's around uh, 25 days. 25 days. What something like that would cost? around uh, $3,500. $3,500. Yeah, and that <laughs> that's a ludilamite with a vivianite. Wow. It's two different minerals. Wow. And what's the name of your company? That's uh, Evaldo Big Stones. Evaldo Big Stones. Yeah. You always have the big blue ones up front. Yeah. All right, and uh, what's something like this cost, more or less? Yeah, one piece like this costs about fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred dollars. Yeah, that is quite beautiful. It looks it's like amazing. Looks like glass. Yeah, it looks like. Is it like glass? Does it break like glass? Uh, actually, that's very soft material. Uh huh. You know. Yeah. So uh, you cannot carve in that 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 material. That the color is like a turning color. Uh -huh. uh, the turning you can carve and you, you fast and do it whatever you want. But this material is just for display, you no, know, just for collection. You cannot carve in that. It's a soft material. Too soft. Yes. And this one here. The same thing. Oh, it's just beautiful. It's actually green, isn't it? Yes, it is. When it, when the light hits it. like this here. You see? Ah, uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so, I, so I just bought this Chinese crystal. China, yeah. Fifty-five dollars. I hope uh, I don't break it. It looks pretty delicate.
So this is uh, amethyst from Brazil? Yes. And what do you call these things right here? Uh, so metaphysical people are calling it a dragon teeth. Dragon teeth? Yes. They come from Bahia, center of Brazil. Ah. And the lighter one you see, it's a reverse termination of a trigonic amethyst. That one? Yes. It's a reverse what? Reverse termination. Oh. Icy amethyst or trigonic amethyst. Ah. And they come from Ceará, northeast. Hey, this is beautiful stone. What is it? This is, is hematite from Morocco. Hematite? Yeah. Hematite. What is this material? This is calcite. Calcite. But it looks so different than other calcite. Yeah. It's uh, looks delicate, kind of like a uh, popcorn. That's beautiful. And that is from from Morocco. All this is from Morocco. Yeah.